Hey guys, thank you for clicking on this video. And so this is a continuation from part one. In case you haven't seen part one, here is the link. Click on it and watch it. That is basically a haul of all the perfumes and fragrances and scents that I got. And this will majorly cover all the cosmetics and palettes that I got. So this is a continuation of my haul video, my very first haul video. Now the first thing that I got in makeup is this ultra palette from Cryolan and this is how it looks it has a variety of colors you can see that this is the darkest color and this is the lightest color and then it comes in a variety of shades and the ultra palette is a very creamy palette so it spreads on really really smooth and really really well and I am so excited to try it because I tried a little bit in the store and trust me guys you know the coverage is awesome the next thing that I got is blusher or contouring palette from Miss Claire I think this is for uh, lighter skin tones because it has a variety of shades um, over here there are all non shimmery shades and over here there are all shimmery shades I really like the the warm tones like if you if you notice this sorry yeah this part these are all very topish mocha peachy uh, baked kind of colors which I think are perfect for Indian skin tones because um, we are naturally caramel brown complexion and to enhance it I think this is a perfect palette the next thing that I got is again not very branded because I already had a lot of branded eyeshadows from MAC and Inglot so I thought that I should get something cheaper this time because I wanted a lot of colors so I picked up this little thing from Miss Rose and it's such a cute package because you know it just looks like a clutch but this is what it looks like see so it has a huge variety of colors they have uh, pinks and purples and greens and yellows and taupes and neutrals and smoky and everything and uh, since this is not a very expensive palette I am definitely not expe expecting a very high quality but for making quick random and lots of videos I think it's it's a good steal to invest on something cheap like this so I'll just oh actually the color payoff is nice wow did you see this it's, it's quite awesome let me swatch it for you wow I think the color payoff is good guys I mean this entire palette cost me 450 rupees which is not bad at all I think it's a very travel friendly pack because uh, it has a very cushiony texture on top so even if it gets squished in your uh, suitcase it wouldn't get spoiled so it's a very travel friendly pack and it has all the shades I think a lot of shades would even double as blusher and contour so you don't have to carry extra products along with you even an eyeliner you know they have a black one over here so these were all the palettes that I got now the next thing that I got is uh, the regular colossal kajal from Maybelline the next thing that I got was these fake nails these are again from Miss Claire and these are not very expensive these are for 100 rupees there are just 40 nail tips in it there are 40 nails in it I think it's gonna last last me like really long I don't expect very high quality from these nails because of course I'm not investing that much of money in it but um, these nails are naturally cut so you don't have to trim them and uh, they are quite opaque if you see the color is quite opaque so whatever color you put on top it shows off really really well so I have been using Miss Claire for uh, false nails uh, from quite some time so uh, my last pack actually got over so I thought of buying it again so if you're uh, looking at investing in a fake nail by Miss Claire then I got some awesome eyelashes and I got the eyelashes from Ardell now this is a brand that I have been eyeing for quite some time I saw this brand um, on some YouTube video I don't remember whose video it was but I was like wow these are pretty natural looking lashes so if you see this this one over here this is a more dramatic lash because it is all thick from inner corner to the outer corner but if you look at this one 
this one is very thin on the inner corners and it goes as it goes towards the outer corner it becomes thicker and this one is actually in number 405 so this will actually give you that fluttering batting eyelash kind of a look where you know the lashes become dense on the outer corner and the shape of these lashes is very natural then the next thing that i got was i definitely you know a good good worksman has to invest in his or her tools so i invested in my tools and my tools are these makeup brushes so these are a mix of makeup brushes from vega and ssiz i don't know what that brand is but they had some awesome brushes and the best thing that i got is actually i got a brush from cryola and this brush is quite expensive because this brush costs me 350 rupees but i think it's worth investing because the kind of finesse that was there in this brush i didn't find it in vega brushes i haven't tried sigma personally if you have tried sigma brushes please let me know how they work how they turned out for you and if i can get them cheaper somewhere on the net if you see the tip is so precise i mean it looks beautiful right and the finish of the brush is awesome because it's all metal and then the best thing is that it actually comes in a protective bottle like cover like this and i think it's a very very travel friendly pack the uh, next thing that i got myself are these bumpets um uh, if you know what bumpets are they're actually there to give you that little puff before kind of a feel in your hair if you regularly use bumpets then do let me know any secrets that you have of using them more efficiently i would love it oh and here is something very interesting i got myself <laughs> this is so funny i haven't shown it to my husband yet because he'll be like what you know he just wouldn't understand okay i got myself fake bangs <laughs> okay don't judge me okay but i Okay, it looks really weird. I'm not sure how you wear them. I think, like, see, like, you just pin them like that. And, okay, so these are like fake bangs that I got myself. I still have to try them out, so I'll let you know how they turn out. They smell like doll hair. They're not real human hair, I'm sure. Although they write that on the package, but it's not. And I got it because I wanted to try a few makeup looks uh, that were a little edgy for Halloween or other upcoming uh, events. So I thought, let me let me try out bangs, okay? Because I am definitely too fat to to uh, try bangs on my own self. <laughs> so I was like, let me invest in fake bangs. And the best thing is that these were really, really cheap, you know. These were just for 100 rupees at uh, Beauty Palace. I got this hair color. This is a temporary hair color. And this is in the shade brown. They even had a shade called coffee. And this actually, you have to style your hair completely the way you want. And then you just spray it from the top. So it forms a layer or a coat on your hair and it gives it that color. Uh, Whenever I intend on using this, I will definitely make a tutorial and show you how it looks or maybe I'll just post a few pictures on Instagram and my Facebook so you guys could see if you're ever planning to invest on something like this, like, you know, instantly changing your hair color. They even had very wild colors like purples and blues and red, but I am not so edgy right now. I think I'll just go for this deeper brown color. And this was very, very cheap. This was for 85 rupees. So I'm sure it's going to damage my hair and everything. But for that, I have got something else. I got myself the most awaited product in my wish list from ever. Yes, you guessed it. I got myself a Moroccan oil, the original Moroccan oil, and this is basically argan oil. Now the 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 label says that argan oil is actually the third ingredient in this. So if you're expecting that this is pure argan oil, you might be in for not a very good surprise because this is not pure argan oil this does have a few chemicals and perfume in it but it has the third ingredient is argan oil which is pretty good because the first two might be there to actually stabilize the product so the best thing about this is that the smell is awesome very very musky very you know typical moroccan smell and 
from the very first use i actually instantly felt a shine and softness and suppleness in my hair the way i was uh, waiting for i am going to do a detailed comparison of this moroccan oil and the kerastase uh, elixir ultime uh, wait for that next video where i'll compare them two together but this i definitely wanted to use and when i have used it for the first time i really really liked it so let's see how over the time my hair react to it the next thing that i want to show you is i got the same argan oil for my skin now if you know that these days argan oil is a huge deal this is by a brand called kiratex and this is pure argan oil this is 100% natural argan oil and uh, it is a very expensive product because for a small bottle like this which is hardly uh, 10 ml i paid some 400 and uh, 50 rupees but i got this for 405 rupees from beauty palace 435 rupees so like 15 rupees discount so this is a very expensive product but i felt the difference on my skin right from the first time i used i bought it day before yesterday and i just used it last night and i i could actually feel a suppleness in my skin in the morning so i just washed my face clean and i took one drop of this and i massaged it onto my skin and in the morning i could actually you know feel the suppleness in my skin it was so awesome so what you can do is you can actually mix it in your daily cream and use it or you can mix it in your night cream or you could just directly apply it on your face if you're not uh, against using oils on your skin this brings us to the end of the second part of this haul i would try to do individual reviews of all these products like down the line and i'll put them on my blog so do make sure you subscribe to my blog to get daily updates and i really hope you guys like it so i'll see you guys in my next video bye and yeah don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you enjoyed this video